what is an algorithm? An algorithm is just a method for solving some problem, right? And kind of the the design space for creating algorithms is huge. Um, so you you know you have to be creative in finding something that works and works well. I enjoy that, and I also enjoy once I understand how to solve a problem, implementing an algorithm and, and seeing it run fast on my laptop. I enjoy watching that too. A lot of the algorithms I I work on, I develop, are algorithms for very large data sets. Data sets that are so large that Maybe you can't fit them in your memory, or you, you at least can't fit them in your fast memory. I work on algorithms that kind of compress the data so that you don't store everything, but you store a very tiny amount, but you can still answer interesting queries about the data. So these are called sketching algorithms. And let's say that I am a big company like Facebook, okay, and tons of people are visiting my webpage every day. There's a stream of data that's coming in, let's say the stream of users that are visiting the website. And now there are, there are things you might want to know about these users, like how many distinct users visited Facebook.com today. So the question now is, how can Facebook efficiently, or whatever company, efficiently process this stream using very little memory? You need an algorithm to do that. It's not obvious that there should be a very low memory algorithm that doesn't have to remember everything. I mean, the most naive algorithm would be, remember every single person who visited my web page. But potentially, this list could get very long, so I have to store a lot. So that's where streaming comes in. The streaming algorithm gives them a way of summarizing the data into a very short synopsis. Me and two friends of mine back in 2010 came up with the first algorithm that is provably optimal for this problem. I think I was in either seventh or eighth grade at some point when I was online browsing. I noticed that if I right-clicked the web page and pressed view source, I could see the source code for the page, which was HTML. And the next time we went on a trip to the mainland US, I bought a book on HTML, I self-studied it, brought it back and practiced making websites. So these are kids who, most of them don't even know what CS is when they start. And they're coming in, it's a four week program, 40 hours per week, and they're, they're staying in dorms. And we're training them like all the way from the beginning, basic introductory programming, all the way to like algorithms. And one of the reasons I really enjoy the program is like watching these kids and getting to a point where they, they actually understand kind of upper division college material in computer science, like algorithms. Mm -hmm.